grabbed a few G.I. Joe classified figures from the Snake Eyes movie. Um, couldn't really pass these up because they were £3 each. Didn't really want them before. Um, have seen the film. It was alright. Um, but I didn't think that these were to the right scale as the other G.I. Joe classifieds that I've got. I mean, these two guys do seem taller, um, but I don't know if it's just that to their scale to each other. Like, this one's particularly tall, the Scarlet is particularly small, that kind of thing. So I'm gonna open them up and have a look to see where they fit. Uh, I did buy two Scarlets. Uh, I am going to attempt to customize this one. Uh, I couldn't really pass up the opportunity since this is only three pounds. It doesn't really matter if I completely botch it up. So there we are, that's why I got that. And as I am literally going to customize one of these, it doesn't really matter about the state of the box. Going to be keeping it anyway. There you go, there's Scarlet. She comes with this little um, crossbow. There we are. That's it. Again, I didn't think that these were to the same scale and everything as the other ones because these two. Um, they don't really come with a lot of accessories, whereas these ones do. The Cobra Commander had extra hands and weapons, and the BAT, I mean that's got loads of stuff with that one. Various, a different head, different weapons, chest plates, all sorts of things. All the kind of things that came with the original toy back in the day. And there is Akiko. I think that's how you pronounce her name. It's been a little while since I saw the film. She also came with this um, bladed staff. As you can see, she is uh, bigger than Scarlet. So the scale thing kind of works. But if you put them with these guys, they are considerably smaller. That will um, put the Scarlet right next to Cobra Commander. Obviously, I don't actually have any G.I. Joe classified figures of people not in um, masks, or obviously, this guy is meant to be a, giant, a, a big robot. So, oops. So, obviously, he is going to be larger so i don't really know whether they will fit entirely um however for scale this guy is a five inch figure as opposed to this guy that's supposed to be six so the doctor is a much um much better size i mean it was like obviously she was bigger in the first place but yeah, there's not a lot of uh, height difference between Scarlet and Max Smith. You've got like similar like head size, like do you remember this, the scale for this one? This doesn't seem the same scale as the other ones. Why I kind of didn't buy them, they were, were always quite cheap in the entertainer. I mean, now they're dirt cheap, so I couldn't pass them up. But I held off getting them because they didn't seem like they, they seemed like they were too small. 